Hi, I'm Quill Kukla. I'm a professor of philosophy here at Georgetown University, where I'm also a senior research scholar in the Kennedy Institute of Ethics. But I'm speaking you today, speaking to you today in my other capacity as the editor in chief of the Kennedy Institute of Ethics Journal. This is the 30th anniversary year of the journal. We were established in 1991, and for a very long time, the editor-in-chief was Robert Veach, who is one of the founding scholars and towering figures of the Kennedy Institute of, Institute of Ethics. He also passed away this past year, sadly. I took over editorship of the journal in 2011. Currently, we're one of the most influential and cited journals in practical ethics. We specialize in conceptually rigorous, practically engaged work in ethics that directly speaks to current pressing real world issues. Much like the Kennedy Institute of Ethics itself, our heart and our history is in bioethics. But at the journal, we conceive of this very broadly to include the ethics and the social significance of science and science policy. This is actually a very important strength for us and one of our main focuses. Environmental ethics, sexual ethics, animal ethics, and really any social and political or ethical issues concerning human flourishing fall within our purview. We do a number of special issues. We're very proud of the fact that we managed to get out an issue on the COVID pandemic by June of 2020, just early on in the pandemic. This issue got over 150 submissions. And so it was really a major early touchstone for ethical work on the pandemic. We've also had issues in recent years on topics including the 2016 election, ethical and social issues surrounding obesity, Asian bioethics, and several others. We have a special issue forthcoming on free speech in academia and another issue honoring Robert Veach. In short, the journal is flourishing. Submissions have skyrocketed over the course of the last decade. They're up about 600%. And it's become a major center for cutting edge, socially relevant, practical ethics. I hope that you'll take some time to look at one of our open access issues or articles. And I also hope that you'll consider us for your next manuscript, if that's appropriate. Thank you.